Hey guys, what's up? Here we are at Cyberbikes. I'm gonna show you how to program the Vafeng controller. Um, I have already the, this is the loom cable that comes from the controller. So I unplugged the display. So this is the display cable, the green one, five pins. I unplug it. And then I have um, a cable here connecting to my computer's USB. So that's a USB to serial port. If you go to device manager, if you have a Microsoft computer, go to device manager, you're gonna find COM9, in this case, USB serial, okay? CH340 is the type of chipset of this USB device, okay? The battery has to be on, okay? So I'm gonna flick it on, and there you go. So I know it's COM9, so I'm gonna minimize the, the device manager. I'm gonna open the Bafang software. And here we are. So we have the Bafang software on. Let's connect it. So I'm gonna type the port that I'm using on my computer, which is COM9, and I press connect. It will read, I don't know if you could see, but the USB just flashed. And so we have all the details from the controller, the voltage and maximum current. Let's read the settings that we have on this controller. Yeah, the, the read was successfully done. Okay, so these are the settings we have at the controller right now. I'm gonna just press again, okay, just to be sure. So as you can see, the controller is at maximum current, 25 amps, what I'm gonna do I'm gonna put a lower voltage cutoff, which will increase the range. Usually the batteries have a lower uh, voltage cutoff than the controllers. Uh, these are the pedal assist settings. I won't change them, even though I can see they're not original. Um, so I'm gonna put uh, a quicker start. Uh, start up current usually it's good to don't increase this above uh 50 percent uh for normal use but if you're gonna go for a drag race you might put a hundred percent this one i'm gonna put that 10 seconds because i want as soon as the the rider stops pedaling i want uh him to to feel that the motor has disengaged and this one I'm gonna put 100%. When I put 100% down here, the pedal assist sensor becomes equivalent to, to the throttle of the bike. So for every modification, I can write it on the controller memory. This is too high. I'm gonna put 36 and I'm gonna put speed because current is, is too jerky, okay. So, throttle, yeah, pedal assist there. This is the basic settings. You can write them individually on the controller. However, you can also write, write flash, bang. And it writes all three tabs in one, in one click. Yeah, that's it. Once you've finished, you can press close the connection and you can turn the battery off. Yeah, bang. Unplug the cables, everything, reconnect the display, and the bike will work according to the configuration that you have set up. That's it.